Details on a story we've been following since the weekend. We now know the name of the young teen who was killed in a fire. This is just absolutely tragic, and investigators believe they know how this fire started. 19 News reporter Brittany Weir has our update. The Jackson Township Fire Department releasing the name of the young boy who sadly died in a house fire here on Harris Avenue over the weekend. The fire chief saying he was Joshua Terry and he was just 13 years old. We're sad, you know. Yeah. Young man just got out of school for the summer, you know, and, and you know, his whole life was ahead of him. Chief Tim Burzik says the Jackson Township Fire Department tried to rescue Joshua from the second floor by using a ladder. Crews made entry through that window as we are extinguishing the fire. Uh, within four minutes of being on scene, we did locate a victim on the second floor. Once they got Joshua out of the house, he was taken to the hospital where he later died. According to Chief Berzik, the fire started from a gas fireplace on the first floor. This young man was uh, messing around with the fireplace and uh, not being malicious, being a 13 year old boy. Joshua's mother was upstairs when the fire started. She heard the smoke alarms going off, went downstairs and saw the fire. It hit a cushion. He was trying to put something out with. So she, Joshua, get outside, get outside. She goes back upstairs to grab her phone, uh, a few things quickly. Well, being a 13 year old boy, he followed mom upstairs. The chief says that Joshua hid in his bedroom. His mom tried to get him out. She thought he was behind her when she exited the house, but he ran back up the stairs. For a lot of children, you know, their bedroom is their safe haven. Chief Berzik says Joshua's death has had a huge impact on the department, and they are grieving with the family. His one takeaway for the community is to make sure you have working smoke detectors on every floor of your house. At the top of the stairs, she had a baby working smoke detector, and that's what alerted her that something was going on. Had that not have happened, you know, the fire was growing, and, you know, him being down here, her upstairs, we could have had two people, two fatalities. In Jackson Township, Brittany Weir, 19 News. And we want to continue to...